Hi guys, how's it going? Welcome to Non-Committal Sims. I am Jo or Lucian, you can call me either. Lucian is my sudden name because I am an indie author as well as a simmer and I also have a beauty channel too if you are interested in that. But today we're back in Cass and we're back for the third instalment of my Sim Seasons. <laughs> Seasons Cash Challenge. So, if you are new here, then I have done a Autumn um, Challenge, and she is actually my main sim in my like um Let's Play at the moment. I also have done Winter, and he is now in the Let's Play too. She has met him, and now I'm gonna do Spring. So, how I do this is I randomly pick a few sims off the gallery. That's not the gallery. That's the gallery. Let's have a look. So yeah, I pick one, like, two sims to breed. So how about you? We'll have you, Paulina Borowick Bur 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 by Zusa6549. So thank you for being the mum. And then I'm going to get the dad. I'm thinking, are you a guy? Yeah, okay. So, oh, it's from the same person, actually. Antony. I'm not even going to try to pronounce that name. I am sorry. <laughs> Just not even going to try. Okay, so we have two sims here. And I'm going to make a bubby. We have a girl, and I do tend to leave it as it wants me to, because we had a girl first time, and then we had a boy, and so now we have you with some really cool shades on, but I can't see your face. So, what we're going to do is age you up to a young adult, and we're going to get rid of mum and dad, sorry. Thank you for being here, though, and thank you to the creator for creating them. Okay, let's have a look at you. So you're going to be spring. Spring. Wait, I'm going to have to change the name because I can't pronounce it. Spring. Or should I call her? No. Spring Rose. I like that. That's cute. Okay, so Spring Rose here with Chester. Do I want to keep you like that? I don't know. I said that you'd be a girl. I, I'm all for body hair, but I don't see... A spring sim with it. I feel bad, but yeah, but you do look really pretty. Like, just saying. You're just like awesome, where I don't think I'm gonna have to do anything with you. Unlike Jack Winter, when I had to change him quite a lot, because to be honest, I wanted him to look like Jack Frost, so I changed him a bit. But yeah, you, you're pretty. Look at her. Oh my god. Okay, but the hair. We're gonna start, and this is a no CC challenge too. I'm gonna make sure she doesn't actually have any CC on. She doesn't have skin details, does she? No. Okay, good. What colour hair do we have? Like, and my UI got to. Ugh. Sometimes, for some reason, when I get into the game, the UI is, like, really big and it's annoying, but I've started it. So now you can see the screen. But yeah, what colour hair? Should we just keep your hair black? Or do we give you ashy? I was like, oh, blonde, but it kind of goes with your skin tone, to be honest, though, doesn't it? Or light brown? Oh, actually... If I put a better hair on her, not the same one that I put on. <gasps> she suits brown hair. Okay. No, you actually suit that colour too. Actually, you, yeah. I don't know which one now. Oh, which one was it? That one. Nope, it was not that one. That one. Hmm, I think I'll go with brown. Yeah, oh, you actually look really pretty. How do you suit that hair colour so well? It's the skin tone. It just goes really nice with it. 
So spring. Oh, we could put a flower in your hair. That doesn't suit you. Never mind. What I was thinking, though, with spring was cottage car. So what I might do is use cottage living for her. Put a little hat on. Nope. <laughs> so I am thinking cottage car, except that. I hate that you can't change the hat colour instead when unless you change the hair colour. Which is really annoying because now I have to put you in blue. Uh okay, what colour is it if I put it on that one? That's nasty. Mmm. That's annoying. I wish they had this but without the hat. Or let us change the colour of the thing. I don't like you. That wasn't the colour that I gave you. Uh, I don't know. See, now I prefer you with this colour hair. We'll just have to go with blue. Or, that's like red and black. That's a very strange colour to have. We'll go with this. Oh, what about this? You kind of suit that, weirdly enough. But I hate the fringes on um, Max's match stuff. Like the clay hair. The fringes just never ever look right. We're gonna go for this one and I'm gonna stop. Right, how do I... is it on body? There we go. Okay, so her clothes. I'm gonna do cottage living because I don't usually use it that much, Um, to be honest. I never even did like the whole le like gameplay of it, but I do think it would go very well for spring. I <laughs> like this. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, this. Oh, I like that one. That's pretty. There's also strawberries. Maybe not that one. That looks like a nighty. I'm pretty sure that is a nighty. That one's nice. And then there's that. Oh, I like that one on you. That looks really cute on you. Okay, so. What should I do? I really like that, but those boots aren't working. Go away. Yeah, I really like that. That's actually really nice. Just doesn't go with a sodium. I mean, it does go because it's got blue in it, but that's very yellow. I don't know if I like that. See, I kind of like that one, but because you're in a blue hat, because it's really annoying. I'm gonna be sat here forever, clicking through them. Hmm. Oh, okay. I think that's really pretty. I was gonna put you in pink, but when I put CC on her she will look different and I'll be able to not have this hair because it's very pretty hair it's just the hat I hate that you can't change the colors <laughs> why sims why but I do like that on her okay shoes what shoes shall, shall we give you wellies <laughs> um you're gonna have to be a gardener yes I kind of like the pink yeah oh I like it yeah it's fun. We can put you, give you some. <laughs> are they marigolds? Is that what you call those gloves? Uh, no, maybe not. But we might give you a little. But then again, if you're a gardener, maybe I'll put that on like the party stuff because I feel like she's a gardener very much. And you wouldn't wear makeup, would you, if you're just in the garden? But I'm going to do the rest of her outfits off camera because trust me I take forever to pick out outfits and does my head in but then we're gonna go through her traits and her aspiration and then I'm gonna put her well then I will put CC on her but if you want to see her in all her final glory you'll have to watch my let's play because she will be going in my game just like the others okay so here is spring rose all done and dusted so Firstly, let's start with her trait. She is an animal enthusiast. She loves the outdoors and is also a green fiend. I'm basically going for that cottage car living because she also wants to be a country caretaker and she wants to tend for the countryside and befriend all the animals. And I also feel I was going to give her the, um, what is it? Eco innovator as well because I feel like she wants to help the environment she's really like conscious about that 
could also give her vegetarian, but yeah, I feel like she is really, really like environmentally conscious and she wants to help the animals basically and the woodlands. So her outfit, so you've seen her everyday outfit, you know, standard, she's going to be out in the garden a lot, doing a lot of weeding and tending to vegetables and stuff, so she doesn't want to be too glamorous, but then we have a formal, I mean, she looks so good in yellow, I love this dress as well, I would wear this dress, it's so pretty, but yeah, and she's just tied her hair back, like, I feel like I did not know it had a bow in it, that's adorable, but I didn't think she would you know really want to go like all out for her hair she just ties it back then an athletic not anything really to write home about sleep i've given her the this thing <laughs> her party again she's just tied her hair back and she's definitely wearing a sweater because you know i mean in england when it's spring it's still cold and rainy and we can still get snow in the spring as well so you know not getting rid of the sweaters just yet and she looks really cute in that i want it looks cozy i want a jumper like that i just want it to be proper jumper weather now because i want to start wearing jumpers and i'm sick of it being too warm for them and her swimwear i really like this um swimming costume i really do her hot weather wear so just yeah, again, she's going to be, like, tending the garden, so not anything like high maintenance. Also, she like really friggin' strong. I was, when I was doing this, like, I'll just show you, like, she's got, like, abs. <laughs> so, I can see her out in the garden and being a farmer. There. And then also her cold weather wear, because she, like I said, she's not very glamorous. She doesn't care for the glamour, but she just wants to help the animals and be a friend to them and so i was going to get put her in willow creek but i think i might have to put her in henford henford upon bagley is that what it's called maybe <laughs> or something like that but yeah i feel like i'm gonna have to put her in there because she just suits that neighborhood to be fair and that is that i really hope you enjoyed this video let me know what you think of our spring rose here do you like her would you change anything about her i am going to be putting cc on her as well so watch out for my next video in my let's play to maybe see her i mean if she's anything like jack she'll just end up at my house at some point knocking on the door but until then guys, thank you so much for watching, remember to like this video if you liked it, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you in another video. Bye!